Hi guys, I was just going to start something else, but my uh, videos of the paper poppers have just been published. And I've had some comments on there, so I'm going to do another one. Let's just see if we can get the original ones working again. Paper popper. There. Turn that through there. Did I do that wrong? Did I do that the whole way around? There, like that. That should be nice and loose. Okay, that one works. And then these are a different design. They do the same thing if you hold them the right way round. That's got to come out. That's got to come out. Oh, it didn't quite come out fast enough. Okay. My grandson was able to get them both to come out. She had a better wrist action than me. Only one. Nope, can't get the other one to come out. Loosen it up a bit more. Try again. I just want to see if I can get both sides to come out at once. Nope, how about that one? He was able to do it every time, and he's only a little lad. Them. Right, so that was the designs that I did. That was Mark 1, that was Mark 2. Links in the video description. Mike Flight pointed out the ones that we used to get free in comics, when the days when you used to have comics, were card sided. So I've got some card there, and then some sort of paper inside to flick out. So I'm going to try and do this completely from scratch. I'm using a piece of a4 card, which is eight and a quarter inches across. We'll cut it in half anyway. Okay, and then we'll fold that in half. be our outside and then a piece of paper in there so when we flick it we tape it around the edges fold it inside and then when you flick it that should come out that's my theory be the same as that, more or less. Well, we can do it more than once, can't we? I reckon that's going to need to be a little bit smaller. And possibly even curve that. Let's just go for general idea. Whether we 
tape it outside or inside. It's going to be interesting trying to tape it. This is completely off the top of my head now, just working it. And you could tape it on, if I taped it on the outside that would be easier. I reckon we probably don't want... that bit either. But I'm not quite sure I'm going to tape it in place. I don't know if I'm thinking this through right or not. That's what we're doing there. We can try it, can't we? If it works, it works. If it doesn't work, we got it wrong. fairly loose so it should come out easily oh yeah <laughs> I don't think it'll last long with my loose way of doing it I suppose I could have taped it that way It's a bit of a fatality now, isn't it? Can we take that back up for now? Just so we can get another crack out of it. That'll last. <laughs> that survived. Yeah. Try it again. Yep. Not sharp enough. Yeah. 
And there you go, there's an alternative. But it's card, not paper. It's losing some of its strength now. Yeah, not quite as loud as the first one, was it? So use some paper that's a little bit stronger. It's getting quieter each time now. Well, there you go. An alternative, or we'll call it version 3 now, because I, or Mark 3. I called the others Mark 1 and Mark 2. That was Mark 1. That was Mark 2. Both just made out of a single sheet of A4 paper. Mark 3, we've got a bit of card. And it looks like we could do with a stronger bit of paper in there because it can't take the force. Yeah, and it's tearing. Right. Done. Well, I've pushed it all the way to destruction there. I've had to tape up this piece a couple of times. I've replaced the piece of paper in the middle because that was completely destroyed and this one I've strengthened with sticky tape across it. It's still tearing so there's a lot of force involved in this one. Might be an idea to well not use paper or if you use paper cover it entirely in sticky tape to make it stronger. And I've taped this one down the outside edge rather than trying to be clever putting it inside straight down the outside edge on both sides that's coming well you can see that's all torn as well a lot of force involved in that yeah it's had it now <laughs> Thanks for watching. There's always more information down in the video description. And if you like this video, you might like this one up here. And you might like to have a look at my channel over here. See what else I do. Thank you for watching.